So I have been ridiculously sick. I am sorry. I have been wanting to do this Q&A video for quite a while. Um, I am just getting over strep throat and it is wiping me out over the past two and a half weeks. I am recovering and if I cough a little bit, I am sorry. So let's get into this. Um, I asked everybody on Instagram in random places, just go ahead, ask questions, I don't care. Um, the first one is obvious. Um, how does it feel to have moved out of state? I lived in the previous place I lived my entire life. That state was my home. That city was my home my entire, entire life up until about nine months ago. And I gotta say, once you, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm shaking the tripod. Um, once you move out of state, you definitely feel different. It's, it's. I don't necessarily love the state I'm in right now, but it's definitely a lot more blissful. I would definitely say the move has benefited both me and Will, and our dog Coda, and our life. It may suck that we don't have that many friends that live here, but we call them and Skype them and, you know, try to visit when we can. So that's, it's definitely different, but it's, it's, um, <laughs> the only thing that kind of sucks is there's like, thrift stores, the thrift stores are like 45 minutes away, so that's, that's the kind of thing that sucks. Um, already answered, kind of answered this question, but is, do you have a boyfriend? Um, actually, yes, as of Christmas, it'll be five years since we went, well, have been together. Um, just wonderful, um, story time I want to do eventually with Will. We, we've actually done this on our stream several times, told our story. It's definitely unique and goofy. Um, another thing that I'm going to go ahead and put in here, I am not in the toy room right now, I'm actually in our bedroom. Uh, I just set up a couple of the toys that I got yesterday because this room is not the cutest right now and I'm not really planning on putting any toys in here other than living dead dolls and creepy things. So right now, me being sick, I don't want to be in the toy room, it's really hot and sweaty in there. So, I'm, I'm working towards that. I'm definitely working towards that. Okay, so the third question is, how did you get into toy collecting? Um, my entire life. <laughs> <coughs> That's kind of how it happened. Um, my mom uh, liked to thrift junk. We've been going to thrift stores since before I was born. Um, I think the first ever thing she thrifted for me was my pink puffalump, lump, which... Um, I call pink bear, but apparently is a lamb. <laughs> <coughs> so, I've been collecting basically since I was really, really young. It's just, the thing was, um, I've gone into different phases of collecting. Uh, I did Lee Middleton's when I was like 10 and 11. I've done American Girls throughout being a teenager, and when I faded out of American Girls, I got into wrestling stuff. Uh, Star Wars was big when I was a teenager. still really love a lot of that stuff. Um, currently now, obviously, BJDs, vintage toys, a little bit of everything, honestly. It's, it's a hodgepodge. A lot of Japanese kawaii things now, um, that definitely started when me and Will started dating. Um, we definitely love the kawaii lifestyle. <laughs> and, um, obviously you see lots of hand, um, anything to hoist story, really. Um, but yeah. <coughs> Sorry about the coughing again. But, yeah, that's... That's basically how it started. It's It's been a whole lifetime process, and um, I've met a lot of people in the community um, where I lived and stuff. Matter of fact, we lived down the street from a lady who um, fixed dolls for a living, and it was amazing. And I only wish she would have taken me under her wing, but it's fine. I know how to do that stuff now myself. Okay, so uh, what are your future plans? That would be question number four. Um, actually, we have plans to move away from where we are right now move to another state, so we'll be three, three or four states away from where we were last year, which is great. Um, I'm, I never thought I would like the country lifestyle ever, like, I've always been a city girl, but there's something that's relaxing when you go to the country on vacation and stuff, and that fresh mountain air and stuff, so I definitely can see that happening, but, uh, that, that definitely is going to happen. That, that, so far, those are the future plans. There are more. That's, that's so far that. Uh, do you have any pets? Yes, I have. We have one pet. 
Uh, he is Coda. He is our doggo. He is a big boy. He's... I don't even know what he is. We're still eventually going to go get him tested to see what he is. But he definitely looks like something German Shepherd. He... he basically, when people ask what he is, we're like, Okay, you know Harley and Joker? Well, he's our hyena. Literally, that's what he looks like. He is a big boy. Okay, so what is my job? Uh, I have had a couple jobs in the past. Um, some of them I really liked, and then some of them, of course, eh. Um, most of my jobs include eBay and eBay. I absolutely love uh, selling things to people, trying to rekindle their childhood nostalgia. That's why I started the channel a long time ago. I actually started the channel not because of that. I started it for me and my sisters so we could have something to do when they get off school. So it started out as that. And then it, like, morphed when me and Will started dating. But my job is eBay. I love that. I love reuniting people with stuff from their childhood. And it, it's something that I do even with my friends. Uh, I've definitely gotten my friends into collecting. They, they're probably a little mad at me, but at the same time, they're very happy with their stuff that they get. <laughs> um, what is my favorite toy? Oh, God. Um, that is a really hard question. When I, when I was, like, thinking about it, I'm like, I, I really don't know. Because I have so many favorite things, like, especially in the toy room right now. Um... I loved Monster High for the longest time, for six years of its production. I loved Monster High, so for a long time it was the Scare Screams Who Dude San Diego Comic Con set, but I sold that a long time ago for a present. And so now I would probably say, hmm, I, I definitely would say it's actually the Rapunzel Disney Store doll that Will got me for Christmas a couple years ago. She Sings and Lights Up and Tangled is one of my favorite Disney princess movies other than Princess and the Frog. And me and Will will actually cry and like reminisce about the movie so much. So that's as far as modern toys goes that one. And then second probably would be my um, Magic Nursery pet because I got really luck finding her. She's a the purple cat. I wish she was in the toy room to actually show you guys right now. Okay, so... My next question, which is probably question seven or eight, I don't even know. I've lost track now. Sorry. Um, what do you think? What? Do you, oh, <coughs> sorry. My cough tied my tongue. Um, what do your friends think about your collecting slash job? Actually, I have so many friends that the moment they see my collection room or Will's collection room, even, um, they get excited when they come in the house. They'll either see the Power Rangers shrine and freak out, or they'll see the Harley Joker collection, or they'll see the Build Bears, or the Ponies, or our Amiibos, which you guys haven't seen yet in the living room. Uh, but then I, I open the door to the toy room and they'll freak out about the Care Bears, or um, the Sky Dancers. Just, you know, simple things from their childhood. So they usually ask me to hunt things down for them and buy things and if I can't like find it to sell to them I will usually give it to them for Christmas which is a great little treat to be able to give people their childhood back which is awesome and they also love my eBay job because like I can do stuff with them I don't know <laughs> we can do stuff anyway um, do you and your boyfriend have stuff in common actually we have a lot of stuff in common um, when me and Will started dating Walking Dead was really popular um, I am not into Walking Dead anymore, neither is he, but we liked Walking Dead. Um, something we both absolutely have a passion for is wrestling. Um, for a while there, when we first started dating, we had a wrestling company. We started together, and you can still watch it on YouTube. But Will doesn't like to talk about it anymore. <laughs> but it's it's still something I love and hold dear to my heart. We still really love wrestling. We watch a lot of WWE together and stuff like that. And... We love collecting toys. We love Toy Story. We love stuff like that. I'm actually going to have to make part two on this just because I have stuff I got to do really quick. So I will be right back. <laughs> 